What is going on guys, DBG here, and today we're gonna to be talking about a player that 2K didn't screw up. Like, if you guys don't know, 2K really screwed up with a lot of the new players. They screwed up with uh, Timmy Thomas. Well, Timmy Thomas isn't bad. Like, look, he's not bad. He's not bad. Danny Ferry, however, sucks. He's awful. Swaggy P's brilliant. But we've also got Ricky Davis right here, who's not bad. Ricky Davis is pretty good because while he can't dribble like he did last year, the biggest thing with Ricky Davis was the jump shot. And he still has the jump shot. He still has the thing that made him Ricky Davis. Because Ricky Davis is a good dribbler, not a spectacular dribbler last year. Like, I get it, he had Jordan Dribble style, which is way better than what he has right now. But, like, he wasn't out here with, like, Stevie si size up and stuff. Like, um, Tim Thomas. But he's still got range. He's still got, um, Agent 3. Agent 3s. He's got 84 three ball. He's got nice steel and perimeter defense. Or, sorry, got mediocre steel and perimeter defense. Terrible interior defense. But he's got nice speed. Not great lateral. He's just going to be a, your offensive guy. He's going to be your offensive guy. And he's going to be pretty damn good at it. I'm not going to lie. He's going to be good. Um, So, let's take a look right here at what Ricky Davis is like. And the big thing with Ricky Davis, again, is the jump shot. So, normal dribble style. Look, it's not good. It's not good. But it's not terrible. Like, you can still kind of move with normal dribble style. Like, no, basic versus normal is so, such a big difference. Like, everyone thinks it's basic. Like, you can still kind of dance around screens. Like, he's not the greatest burst in the world, but, like, you can still kind of accelerate. You can still accelerate. You can't burst, but you can accelerate. That's the thing with normal dribble style, is you can at least accelerate. But he still has got... um. The, uh, the release. It's the release. That's why people like this card. The release. The reason why I love Tim Thomas, or not Tim Thomas, Ricky Davis last year was the fact that, like, he could shoot from anywhere and he could shoot anything because of that release. It was quick. It was easy. And this year, it's on normal time, but it still feels like last year's on quick. Problem is, he does not have a good escape. If he had a nice escape dribble and can get guys into crab situations, he would be very effective. But, yeah, the, the uh, Oscar Robinson upper is still really nice. He's still got a nice fadeaway. He's not going to be Ricky Davis, but like later on in the year, by the way, he's still got that Seth Curry, Oscar Robertson release, which this release, by the way, on quick, when he gets that release, so he could very well come out in season four as an Amethyst or a Diamond card. When we get the real Ricky Davis, he's going to be still insane. Like Tim Thomas's release is okay. His dribbling is non-existent, but I'm telling you, this is still one of the best releases in the game. Like they actually... He's actually still good. They didn't ruin him. Like, he's not brilliant, but they didn't. It's not like with the other cards where we can say, oh, these cards suck and they're going to suck later on in the year. Like, if Ferry, no matter what they do to Ferry, if he has that scrub release, he's going to suck. But the thing is, Ricky Davis is a dribble style upda update and defense update away from being a elite two guard again this year. So expect Ricky Davis to be one of those guys later on in the year that people use to three hunt. Because there aren't that many guys that can three hunt this year. So we just greened a big three there. Now we're going to go and play a game. I've got my... Uh, got to go play a game right here. I'm trying to think what I have... Uh, what I have to do. I'm just going to get him out and Simmons recorded. You wonder why I play a TTO? Have you experienced latency, the latency yet? And the latency is so bad. Like, that's all anyone is complaining about. The latency in games. And you know what mode doesn't have much latency? This one. It's also my favorite mode, so. Like, TTO is my favorite mode, so I'm not gonna, like, any excuse to play TTO, I'll play TTO. But yeah. Let's take a look uh, at who we are playing right here. Jerry West, free agent, and Scotty Barnes. Okay, not a great lineup. And by not a great lineup, I mean a very weak lineup, and we should comfortably win. Okay, it's a tough shot, I guess. And, of course, a white is hit against me with a guy with a 74 rated 3, if I'm not mistaken. Got him. Load up.
screen. Good shot there, Ricky Davis. Like, he still has that ability to shoot the ball in anyone's face. Which is good, because that release is just so nice. Is he going to shoot it? No, he's going to take it to the basket. Good job. I could lose this game. Even losing this wouldn't be the worst thing in the world. Especially with the guys my opponent has. He's in a free agent as well, Ami. That's another hell shot there by Ricky Davis. Come on. Like, he's still got it. Like, everybody talking. Like, in my chat, the people everyone complained about. Like, the guy that most people complained about was Ricky Davis. Like, of all three of these guys, Ferry, Ricky Davis, and Tim Thomas, the guy that most people complained about was Davis. And I'm like, he's so much better than, uh, than both the others. Yeah, to be fair, Tim Thomas is decent. He may not be better than Tim Thomas. He's so much better than Danny Ferry. Ferry's, like, unusably bad. Is he just not... I don't know what he's doing on Chris Bosch, but... Is he, does he think Chris Bosch is a scrub? I think he might think Chris Bosch is a scrub. And not like a gauntlet reward. And there's no chance I'm doing a CTO gauntlet. I've tried it once, I'm done. I attempted it once, that's me done. With that awful game mode. Especially with the season three latency. Like nobody plays this game in Europe as well, which is the funniest part. So it's like, you can't even say, oh, the latency's bad because there's too many people. Oh, man, this is Europe. Nobody plays this game in Europe. I wish he had some way of just getting open a little bit. Because that jump shot is... Make... Can somebody make a white? Again, if you guys don't know, I have not made a white in my last 20 games. I am on a 100-plus miss streak on whites. Um, open, contest... To be fair, like... Contest... Of those 100, probably 30 of them were contested. A lot of them wide open, though. But yeah, we just cannot hit them. My account's glitched, I think. And like, if I'd made, whatever, if I'm making like, if I made three or four out of 100, then it's just, oh, whites don't go in. But like, whites go in for my opponent. Great shot. Ricky Davis is just so good. Not this specific Ricky Davis, but Ricky Davis in general is so good. So Ricky Davis later on in the year is going to be one of the best cards in the game. And who's the guy? Is it like Ben Shepard or something? The guy who they gave Swaggy P his base? Apparently he's a guy that is like elite, elite shooting wise. From what I've heard, he's like, if they ever give him a card later on in the year, he's going to be elite. Good defense. Nope, that's a foul. I'm trying to trigger. I hate how hard it is to trigger takeover this year. Like, I'm spamming to trigger it. It's like, oh, I lost takeover. Really? I got fouled in a three and lost takeover. Give me that. That felt good. That's good, though. Really? So the last one slightly early, slightly late, and I'm pretty confident they both felt the exact. That's way off. <laughs> Jesus. I don't know how I got the speed up of hell right there. Oh, I'm barely ahead in this game. I need to actually lock in here for a second. Nope. Definitely nowhere near takeover right now. Maybe? Got him. Green. There we go. I'm apparently after all those misses, I now have takeover. Game makes a lot of sense. Okay, that's a foul, I guess. Let's go and get some stops. I need a couple of scores here. Please just shoot it. Good. Trigger takeover, please. I could have swore he had sharp take. Oh, he's got the freaking jerk off. 
tra uh, take over. Give me that. And you still shoot from deep, I guess. Give me that. Shoot it. Like, he's still him. <laughs> he is still him. Like, if he had Jordan... If they gave him Jordan dribble style or the... Cur even think of normal dribble style. If they gave him, like, the pro behind the back. Or the freaking... Curry slide or something. Or the Harden shuffle. We would still be looking at one of the best players in this entire game. As far as just offense and three hunting goes. And that is the fun... That's the most fun part of the game. And he's one of the most fun cards to use in this game. No question about it. 